Hi, how are you all doing? Today we will learn how to draw this toucan in Procreate. Let me start with the sketching. I am going to select the 6B pencil from the sketching brush pack. Start drawing with the beak. It is going to be a rough sketch. You don't need to worry about the perfection. We can correct it even later. So start drawing the beak part now. Draw an oval right below the beak which is going to be the body part. Now start connecting the upper part of the beak with the oval. And similarly with the lower part. Now start drawing the wings. In the oval try to split the wings. I want the right side wing to be a little bigger one. So I am sketching it wider and draw the body part of it below the wings and also try to add the tail to it. Start sketching the eye part and also the beak area. This is going to be a rough sketch. So yeah, draw the eye and then let us consider this toucan is sitting on a branch. So try to add a branch. And yeah. Then yeah, start adding the legs. Along with the claw. You can also add more details to the bird. But I am going to keep it simple. As it is just a sketch. So I will just keep it simple you can also create a new layer and create a final sketch of this token but let me go with this sketch create a new layer and call it as base color drag this layer below the sketch layer and select the monoline brush and start drawing the head and wings part of it The head and wings are going to be in one separate layer. Drag and drop the color. Now add another layer and try to add the small body part which is available between the wings and tail in this layer. Again drag and drop the color. Now create one more layer and try to add the tail. Create a new layer above the base color layer and rename this layer as beak. Select the yellow color from the palette then start drawing the beak. Create a new layer above the base color and activate the clipping mask. Now change the blend mode of the sketch layer to divide as I am unable to see the sketch. Select white color from the palette, color the eye area and fill it with the white color. Create another layer and activate the clipping mask. Now select the orange color from the palette and start coloring the eye area. I am changing the blend mode to normal now in the sketch layer. Create a new layer and select the blue color from the palette to create the eye area. Adjust the size using the transformation tool. Fill it with the blue color. Create one more layer and select the black color from the palette and create the eyeball. Create a new layer on top of the beak layer. Select orange color from the palette. Select the paper texture brush and start shading the beak. Apply little pressure and adjust the opacity as per your wish. Now select the dark orange color from the palette 
and start shading the bottom part of the beak. Also select a red color from the palette and apply gently on the lower part and upper part of the beak. Create a new layer with clipping mask activated. Select the mono line brush. Draw the beak part. Fill with the black color. Draw an oval shape in the beak and fill it with black. Draw a smooth line along the beak. Now select the white color from the palette. On top of the black eyeball, I want to highlight the eye. So increase the size of the brush and create a round dot on top of the eyeball. I want to erase the white part in the head area so I am using the monoline brush and deleting now this looks fine select the black color and select the base color layer try to add the feathers just like this Fill the black color in that part. Similarly, add the feathers in the right wing as well. Create a new layer on top of the base color layer. Select the grey color from the palette. Start drawing the feather. Like the one I am showing now. Fill it with the color. Create one more layer to draw the feather part on the right side. Fill it with the color. Rename this layer as left feather. And the other one as right feather. Now select the eraser tool with the texture brush, paper texture which I am using in this tutorial. And try to increase the size of the brush lower the opacity and start erasing from the top we just need the lower end of the feather so that it looks good similarly on the left feather try to erase the top part You can also use the airbrush uh, for erasing the part. I have attached the brush which I used in the description box. You can download from the Gumroad site. Create a new layer and try to create the same effect which we did last time drag and drop the color and start erasing from the top Lower the brush size as per your need. In the top area you can have a bigger brush size. In the lower part reduce the size. Create one more layer on top of the right feather layer and create the same effect.
Select the base color layer and activate the alpha lock and using the paper texture brush start outlining the edges. So this acts like highlight. Now turn on the visibility of the body part and start outlining with the gray color and turn on the tail part add a new layer with the clipping mask option and start outlining the edges select the tail layer and activate the liquify option reduce the brush size and make some wavy effect in the end so that it looks natural like a feather select the clipping mask layer available above the body layer select the orange color from the palette using the paper texture brush start painting the body part to give some effect it's up to you if you need you can add it I like to add so I, I have given if not you can just leave it as such create a new layer underneath the tail layer and select the brown color from the palette using the mono line brush draw the branch Fill it with the brown color. Now select the dark brown from the palette. In the organic, select the mountain ash brush. Activate the alpha lock on this layer and start drawing on that layer. Select the yellow color from the palette. Select the rectangle brush from the textures brush set. Highlight the branch area like this. Select the brown color from the palette and using the mono line brush, draw the leg part of it. Use the dark brown to draw the claw area. Alpha lock the layer and using the soft brush highlight the leg area. Select the black color. Draw some patterns on the leg. Create a new layer. Drag it underneath. Select green color from the palette. In the organic brush set, select the snow gum. Start drawing the textures like this. It creates a effect like Toucan is sitting on the tree. Now start merging the layers. I am merging the eye part. You can merge the layers by pinching them. You can see my videos on introduction to procreate where you can learn the basics. Now merge all the layers together. Select the background color. Move the token to the center. Now this looks good. I hope this video is helpful. If you like this video, 
please like share comment and subscribe to my channel thank you